Good morning, boys and girls. Welcome to Shen Plays. Welcome back to Byzantium here on EU4 Cossacks. Last episode, we took over Crodes from the Knights, and uh, we talked about how we're going to get Negroponte from Venice. There's two possible options. One, which is what I'm trying first, is supporting Rebels. We can get Rebels there. It's just going to take some time. Uh, let's see, he's got positive stability. He's got Republican tradition. He's got local traditions. Republican cultural sufferance, fair laws. He's got a lot of modifiers that are helping him avoid a revolt. But we are supporting rebels here, and we may get rebels. It could happen. Just give it some time. We're also looking at vassalizing Serbia. And to do that, yeah, his allies are garbage. To do that, we would call in Hungary. Hungary is at seven favors, and in three years, we'll be at ten favors. So it's almost time to bring Hungary into another war. And I do think they would be a great ally to help in that war. But we need to beef up our military first. Our military is pretty dire. We have, what, 15 troops? We got 15 troops. Our limit's 21. We need to build some more troops. Uh, what do we want? I think I want to save for cannons, really. I mean, cannon tech is coming. Cannon tech is coming, whether we like it or not. We're three years ahead, though. I think I should spend some of these military points on developments, because currently our development is very, very... Oh gosh, why does this keep happening? Every time. Currently our development is very heavy on Admin and Diplo, like Czech Edirne, 772. Macedonia, 662. It's just very heavy on Diplo and Admin. Even our capitals at 995. 662. Yeah, I tell you what. We're going to spend Monarch points on um, getting this military score up. So let's do it in provinces that have decently low autonomy. Hmm. I think that's worth it. Good way, good way to spend our military points. I don't want to tech up too early. Yeah, we might, if we don't, if we don't get rebels quickly, then um, we'll just take that province in the war with Serbia, because Serbia is allied to Venice. It's very likely that's what we'll have to do. But I don't want to do that just yet, because I want my manpower to come back, or manpower is very low. And I also want to get... Um, I also want to get the Revolt Risk down if I can. We have Ottoman Separatists, and if we can't get the Revolt Risk down, then I, what I want to happen is I want to fight the Rebels before we go to war. I don't want to have Rebels spawn while I'm at war, you know what I mean? I'd rather fight them first. They're at 60% right now. Yeah, the Revolt's probably not going to happen. Let's just stop supporting it. It's too expensive. It's three ducats a month. Three ducats. Yeah. Okay. So save three ducats a month. Let's get our troops home. Come on, then. There we go. There we go. Let's get our troops home. Get ready to fight those rebels in Hudavendigar or Bigar, or wherever they're going to spawn. Somewhere over there. And let's get a couple more soldiers. What do we need? Uh, I, think, I think I'm just going to save for cannons. I'll save all that room for cannons. Well, how many cannons do we need at the start? Seven cannons would be excessive. Let's get... Um, Two more soldiers, I'll delete my Merc, and then we'll get some cannons. Actually, no, I'll keep the Merc. Fuck it, I can afford a Merc. 
It's just one. I just want one Merc mummy. Just one. Persia and the Ottomans have white peace. Okay, that's fine. Persia's my ally, by the way. For whatever reason, we've got Persian allies. Why not? The music's too low? Don't give me that bullshit. Just a few minutes ago, you said the music was too loud, so I turned it down. Oh, yes! Yes, Byzantine separatists in Genoa. I love it. That's fantastic. That is just fantastic. <laughs> oh, I love it. So that should flip to us for free. And it looks like the Ottomans are just going to let this shit flip away as well. So Wallachian and Separatists will probably succeed over here. Oh no, Genoa! No! Lose, Genoa, lose! Come on, Genoa, you can lose, baby. It's okay to lose, Genoa. Damn it, Genoa's going to win. Fuck. Oh, man. Oh, that was so close. Poop. So much poop. I don't need a fort here. Well. No, I don't need a fort here. I want a fort in Thessaly, though. Marketplace. Where else should I have a bit of marketplace? Let's see. Province trade power. Constantinople, Huda Vendigar. Nowhere else makes any sense. Just those two. And we already have them. Hmm. What else can we build? Local manpower from a barracks would be nice. Barracks would be good. 625, 500, 625. Okay, let's build the barracks in Athens first. And then we'll put one in Constantinople. Try threaten war? Mm, you mean on Venice? Or on Genoa? Let's see. Venice. Threaten war. They hold no unoccupied provinces that are cores or claims. Okay. Threaten war. Nope. Negative 31. He thinks his alliances are good. And he's right. He's in the Empire. But Venice? What if we fabricate here? That is a good idea. I had not even considered that. Well, if Serbia won't give me a province, I don't think Venice will. But we'll see. Oh, wow. The Oirat. Look at that. They just took over a whole bunch of Uzbek. Uzbek is almost dead. They're almost dead. Also, let's get relations back up with Muscovy. Moskva. Moskva. Oh, wow. Georgia and Armenia are going at it. Who's going to win this war? Defender against Georgia. The Georgian conquest of Sanche. They want this one. Now, it looks like Armenia is winning that war. Shit. Shy Sky Shadow Wing. Thanks for subscribing. Put some love in chat for Mr. Sky Shadow Wing. Thank you for supporting the channel. Hey, Valakia's independent. Hello, Valakia. You want to be a vassal? No? Alright, well, we'll, we'll, eat, we'll eat you later. After Serbia. Also, how long is our truce with the auto derps? 48. 10 years of truce. Okay. That's fine. How's our trust? Or our favors? We're at nine favors. Okay. Seventy rebels. Hmm. Well, they haven't spawned yet, and they may not spawn, right? There's always a chance that they won't spawn. Still have 12.5 years of separatism. Non-accepted culture. Yeah. 
We need to take some more land over here so we can accept Turkish culture. That's going to be really important to us. Accepting Turkish culture would be great. We're at 15% Turkish right now. What else do we have? Albanian? Albanian. Yeah, we're probably just going to culture convert Albanian. There's no reason to have this culture here. Okay, they're at 80%. Let's fund our army. I hope they just spawn. I would love just to kill the rebels and move on, right? Just get it over with. Get another barracks going. Have I ever formed the Kingdom of Jerusalem? I have not. Okay, when's tech? One year, okay. So we're coming up, we're six months away from tech. And let's see if we can threaten war with Venice. I don't think so. Uh, no. 53 reasons, no, no, no. <laughs> he says no. Aw, that makes me sad in my pants. So sad. I guess I should get back to fabricating on the Turks. Uh, Coachelli, definitely. I want the coast. All of the coast, all of it. You can convert all distant lands to Serbian. It would be cheaper than converting to Greek. Uh, that's not true. Uh, the way it works is it's cheaper to convert it to provinces that, to cultures that border the culture you want to convert to. For instance, if I want to convert stuff to Greek, then it's cheaper to convert it to provinces that border a Greek province. For instance, over here is Greek, Greek, and this one's Albanian. So it's going to be 25% cheaper to convert this province because it borders Greek provinces. However, let's say for some instance, we owned all of this land over here in the Oirat Horde. Well, this province, which is Oirat culture, does not border any Greek provinces. So I could convert it to Greek, but it would cost a lot. A lot more than converting something that borders a Greek province. No, you can't be a march. Shut up. Stop being a march. What time is it Pacific? 2 p.m. It's 2 p.m. here. Do we not have an air? Oh yeah, we do have an air. That's right, we have Schnarf. Okay, I kind of want my current king to die, so I'm going to put him in an army. It's about time for you to die, Eostinos. You are a garbage king. Garbage emperor, Basilius. Basilius the Derp. Gino was embargoing me. I'll just embargo you right back. Jerk. All right, there's the tech. There we go. It's time for cannons, baby. Y'all ready for some cannons? Y'all ready for some cannons? Mmm. Do it, baby. All of the cannons. All of the cannons. How much development do we have? Let's take a look. We have 184 developments. 15 provinces. Not bad. Not great. They're at 90% progress on revolting. Cool. Go ahead and revolt. See if I care. Well, they haven't spawned yet. 
kind of wish they would. What is this? Uh-oh, Hungary got in a war. God damn it, Hungary. All right, so we're not going to declare on Serbia until Hungary is ready to rock. And he's not ready to rock right now. He's busy. Go ahead, spawn. Spawn, you filthy rebels. Oh my goodness, the Mamluks lost. The Mamluks lost to the Ottomans. That's hilarious. And the Ottomans have now built a second fort in Hamid. Oh wait, no, that's their capital. It's not a fort, it's just their capital. Hmm, okay. I thought their capital would go to Ankara, but nope. They still only have one fort. So weird. Go on. Spawn then. Oh wow, they lost two allies as well. The Ottomans lost alliances with Morocco and Tunis. Very good. What was that? Fabricated on Coach Alley. Good. Fabricate on... Let's see, Bolu. Yeah, let's get Kutaya. Fabricate on Kutaya. Come on, spawn your damn rebels. Spawn your damn rebels! Did the knights get Malta? They did! Hey, the knights got Malta from Aragon. Well, good for you. I think that happens through an event, right? If they lose roads, they get an event for Malta, I think. And then Aragon either says yay or nay. Spawn! Oh, God, they're not spawning. So frustrating. How many languages do I speak? Um, one? Speak English, baby. The only thing I know how to speak. I can say, un sola toilette, which got me some weird stares. I was at a, I was at a um, department store in France somewhere. And I had to ask where the bathroom was, but I didn't know the word for bathroom. So I just said toilet, which is like, where's the toilet? But it was a department store. So they had, they sold toilets in the department store. So they pointed me to the section where they sold toilets. It was very helpful. Lower autonomy. Um, I can't do it because I raised it recently. We might be able to lower autonomy some places though. Maybe. No, we really can't. Hey, Iraq is independent. Hello, Iraq. Did I use those toilets? No. Someone there did speak English and they were able to help me. Saleh de Bain. Okay, I, I wouldn't be able to pronounce that. It would have been helpful if I was in the market to purchase a toilet. You're right, but I wasn't in the market to purchase a toilet. Oh, wow. Um, so I thought, I thought, um, I thought Armenia was doing pretty well in that war, but apparently they got fucking full annexed. So they didn't, they didn't quite live up to the hype. At least not fully. Why don't you destroy the fort in Moria? Because I want to keep it. Tyrannical nobles. Lose base tax in Albania, or don't lose base tax in Albania. How about I don't lose base tax in Albania? What a dumb question. Hey, hey, player, would you like to lose base tax? No? Oh, okay. I was just curious. You know, maybe you want to lose some base tax. Maybe you want to go fuck yourself, game? It's such a dumb question. Would you like to lose base tax? 
No. Okay. No pressure. Uh-oh. Speak this with your accent. Esto, Yogando, Europa, Universalis, Agora, Pesol. <laughs> what language is that? Is that Portuguese? Oh, God. Yeah, I'll never get that right. France has no air. Ooh. Would you like to make babies? Oh, he's only 16 years old. He doesn't want to make babies. Darn it. Oh, Oirats are falling apart. Tribes. Tribes. No. Yeah, Horde's tribes are pretty broken. Why aren't these guys rebelling? Oh my god. Rebel! You know what? I bet I can make them rebel if I move out of Biga. Let's just get out of the way. I think that'll make them rebel, right? Maybe? Maybe not. They just don't want to spawn. They're being little jerks. Bronze cannons in Aragon. Yep, bronze cannons everywhere, baby. How many can I afford, by the way? Um, three more. All right, let's get two more cannons. Um, if I get rid of that mercenary, I can get one more. Nah, I'm okay with that. I'll just stick with four cannons for at the start. Four cannons is pretty good. Start out. Rebels will always spawn in the highest development province in the rebellion area. You sure about that, Jelvery? <laughs> Where did I move? I moved to Portland, Oregon. About... Eight months ago? Something like that? I moved in June of 2015. How are we doing on uh, favors over here? Six favors, huh? Not bad. All right, let's get some more claims on the Auto Turks. We still have seven years of truce there, but I want to get some claims going, baby. Let's get Sugla. The more of the coast, the better. Consider eating Cyprus. The problem is. Uh, Cyprus is guaranteed by the Mamluks, and I really don't want to fight the Mamluks right now. Like, they start the game guaranteed by the Mamluks. Okay, Hungary's winning his war, that's great. But he's still busy. Still busy, and I still don't have my rebels spawning yet. Serbia for our support? Yeah, I want to declare on Serbia for sure. What happened to your roommate? Oh, he's downstairs. Well, actually, he's up in Seattle right now, but normally he's downstairs. Okay, we we no longer have our war reps from the, from the Turks. You can tell our economy is hurting because we're no longer getting those war reps. It makes a big deal. 11 rebels in Adirn gain loyalty. I don't think I want to fight rebels right now. I mean, the other option is maybe we just find an advisor for lowered revolt risk. No, it's not available. Because if we just get an advisor for lowered revolt risk, this would go away. Hohenzollern? Yeah. Hohenzollern was a fun campaign. Don't forget Corfu. Well, I'm not forgetting Corfu. It's just a matter of I can't do Corfu. Um, oh, you mean I should fabricate on him? I guess I should, yeah. The plan is to declare on Serbia to take... Negroponte from Venice during that war, vassalize Serbia during that war, and take Corfu in a separate war at the same time. Because Corfu is allied to Hungary, but Hungary will be helping us in the war against Serbia. At least that's the plan. Where is he in Seattle? He's in... 
What is that town with the, the, the B? It's north of Seattle. Starts with a B. Is it Bellingham? I don't know. Whatever it is. North of Seattle. How are we doing? Six favors, huh? Favors every two years? Ugh. Gross. Bellevue? Is it Bellevue? I don't know. I don't know. He's just visiting a friend up there. Berlin? Yeah, you're right. It's Berlin. You got it. Berlin, Washington. It's right on the... Um, it's right on the Canadian border. Berlin, Washington. You got it. Oh, we lost our marriage. Gross. Um, give me the marriage back. Yay! Now, Georgia wants an alliance, and I do think he's a good candidate for an alliance at the moment. He's looking nice. Um, but I really don't want to screw anything up over here, so I'm going to try to keep relations high. Look at the time. All right, we'll have to call this an episode then. Sorry, no action today. Well, come back in the later and we'll get some action for sure. But it's got to be the right way. If we declare this the wrong way, we'll be fighting because they have 20,000 troops. Venice has another 20,000. We'd be fighting 40,000 troops with only 22. That would not work out. We kind of need Hungary's help here. Anyway, thanks for watching. I'll see you next time. Have a good day.